We've been told for years now that applying sunscreen early, liberally, and often is our best protection against cancer-causing UV rays from the sun. Bob Littlefield is proof positive of what happens when you don't. He grew up on the beach in the days before sunscreen. Two different melanomas, over nine uh, squamous cells. The most common and popular sunscreens on the market are called chemical sunscreens because they rely on compounds that are absorbed by the skin to form a UV barrier. But now an FDA study in the Journal of the American Medical Association finds that some of those chemicals are also absorbed into the bloodstream at levels the FDA says requires proof that they cannot do harm. But the chief of dermatologic and cosmetic surgery at the Mount Sinai Health System says that's not the same as saying these ingredients are harmful. It might be necessary to do further studies to look into the levels, a higher level, and see if there is, they're associated with any toxicologic systemic effect. The good news is that there are good alternatives to the chemical sunscreens. They're called physical or mineral sunscreens because they use zinc and titanium to block UV rays, but they can leave the skin looking slightly whitewashed. Still, most dermatologists agree with the Skin Cancer Foundation's response to the study. The sunscreen ingredients currently FDA approved have been used in the U.S. for many years, and there is no evidence that these ingredients are harmful to humans. There is, however, substantial evidence showing that sunscreen helps reduce skin cancer risk as well as skin aging. Dr. Corisani also pointed out that the study was small, just 24 volunteers who spread sunscreen over 75% of their body four times a day for four days. And this test was done indoors without sunlight, heat, sweat, and all the other variables that could have altered the results that you might see out on the golf course, at the beach, and so forth. So for now, I'm wearing sunscreen. Okay. Thank you, Dr. We're going to do as you do. Thank you, Dr.